What's up guys? Today we are here with another fire alarm system test on my bedroom fire alarm system. So let's get into it. Starting off, we have a Siemens, I think it's an MS-51 fire alarm pull station at our main pull station spot. This one's used, um, has a little bit of paint scratching, but overall it's great and it works. Then if we go up, we have my Siemens UMMT-MCS, and this is the multi-candela model. It's set on code 3. We come over here by the panel. We have my uh oh god, I just tripped on that. Um, we have my MDL spot with a cover plate. Um, looks terrible, but it works. And then we have both monitoring modules. And we also for our pull station spot, we have my Siemens agent release dual action. I think it's an MH501 pull station and oddly enough it's actually hard to pull because this doesn't go in as far as like the BG10. It's maximum right there. If we come over here we have my STI emergency push station. This is wired into supervisory as it always is. This probably won't change so just don't expect anything new to happen there. Then if we come over here to my enunciator everything's normal. And if we go up, we have, I think it's my U-S75W white Siemens remote strobe. And this is on fixed 75 candela. And my UMMT is on 30 candela. I don't know why I like that so much. Now, we do have expansions. So, if we follow this wire mold up, we get to a GE449CST. And this is the new smoke detector on the system. It looks a lot like a smoke alarm, but it actually wires as a smoke detector, a four wire smoke detector. And that's wired in as device three on this monitoring module. So we will be testing that today with a blow dryer on the, it has a heat and a photo sensor along with a magnet test that never seems to, or never seems to work or always takes forever if it does. But yeah, so we'll be testing that today also. Okay, so let's get started with the fun part, that is setting the alarms off. I have a screwdriver that holds drill bits, and it's holding the 964th bit that fits this pull station. So I'll be able to reset it fairly fast instead of using the slow hex wrench set. Grab it right here, that takes a while. So, anyway, let's go ahead and unplug the panel so that we can get our filter DC current, because the UMMT sounds terrible on FWR, even though it's rated for FWR. That's a funny thing. So let's wait for our battery trouble to come in, or our power trouble. Okay, and we can go ahead, pull our MS-51 in three, two, one. There we go. I love the UMMT. This brings me back to my elementary school setup. They had UMMTs and addressable MS-51s, the older style. I don't know exactly what the model was. You can get some of that awesome strobe action for here. So let's go ahead and pull our second pull station. That is the MH-501. So here we go in three, two, one. Okay, so let's go ahead and reset the panel, and I will come back once the panel has reset. Okay, so I forgot to reset the pull station, so I already reset the other one. I'm just going to reset this one. So we just unscrew, and then we put it back, 
and we start to screw it back in. And you want to make them too tight or they'll break the pull station. Then we go back down and actually reset our panel. So I'll be back once it resets for real this time. Okay, so now we're going to go to the part where we did test our new detector. So I'm just going to use a blow dryer, it's an old blow dryer, to activate the heat sensor, which is right there. It's inside the detector. I might open it up in a later video. So let's take our blow dryer and turn it on. Okay, I cannot silence the detector because it is on resettable power, so to silence it you simply just have to press the reset button and it cuts the power fairly quickly actually to it for the amount of time it takes to reset. Um, and while this is resetting, let's just have a little fun and activate our emergency push station. So here we go. And just head back over and reset it. Anyway, guys, that wraps up our video. Hope you enjoyed. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.